Continue my school. This is a fine place to start the town next time. When the prince was struck by the sands of time, something was woken within. Something strange and cunning. Something dark. The seven years spent on the run had embittered the prince and made him hard. This burden sustained his other half, gave it strength. The prince was tempted to do as it said, for it was a light in the darkness. Offering comfort and guidance to a man who had just lost everything. But what were its intentions? Why did it help him? Only time will tell. This where I should resign. I will continue my story from here next time. Babylon, but so far away. As a child, father would tell me stories. Pay attention. Something's happening down there. Vizier! He has been completely transformed! Interesting. He has used the power of the sands to transform his army. But this tale is... And these artifacts will allow him to transport them across the city with ease. He appears to be in complete control. Things do not look too good for you at the moment. I will not let the Vizier have Babylon! My city! My throne! He has used that beam as a gate. We will follow him through it. Well done, Prince. Your inaction has allowed them to call for reinforcements. Oh, <laughs> 
Well, that certainly went according to plan, did it not? You really should know by now that entering portals made of sand only leads to trouble. I will simply have to resort to a more traditional form of transport. Hopefully with greater success. Separate them into two groups. Send the weak ones to the house. The strong must go to the palace and arena for changing. Thank <laughs> you. 